they who strike first in the semi-final. Here comes the Spanish response. Just made out. Seven points per game in this championship score. A high of 28 against Poland, a career high. That is correct. Process attempted to respond to Spain. And to say the ball knocked away from it. And the white shirts and possession. Via. And it's by Paul Aste. Worked it well. Well, if we take it, we are the oldest still in space. Well worked, clean move there. Well, turnover to face as well as four points to face. With three minutes in the first quarter to go. Staying out as well. Just not dropping at the moment. With Kovulovic for Serbia. That is rather more successful for Spain. They take the lead with a fabulous effort from Hibana. Perfectly judged. First three points out of this semi final. Those three points that separate the sides now. We're averaging 7.1 points per game. The point four from Valencia. We better from Spain as well. We get a second goal for well, Laura Hill and Zexo Mansus that time. By Cassess. Yeah. That's the chance here, that's fallen short. Yeah. Rebound again is converted. Yeah. Spanish with reason to bang the drum just now. That one as well. Second time we've seen both free throws go unconverted. Very fairly dominant at the moment. And Puglia needs to regret that. The contest goes on. Straight out as well. It's well won back. Here's Roy Hill looking to make amends. He's done well. Punch Rodriguez. Will be the last real attack of this first quarter. Leona Rodriguez. Keep it up in the end for Humano. We'll have another go. Right on the hooter. Could have lifted any later, but it will count from Humano. Eight points for her in that first quarter. We're back on the defensive here. This is Tonya Perez. Rodriguez scoops it up. Quite up and in. Keeps it going, keeps the pressure on. This is by Spain, Rodriguez gets in behind and converts Cooley uh, from Las Palmas in Gran Canaria. So now plays in America with Florida leading their recovery. If you can classify it as a recovery at this rather premature stage. And certainly started the second quarter strongly that. An eight situation. Attempted to respond against Serbia now. 20 points to 14. They love to respond quickly. And they do through Via. Giorgio from Barcelona. Made too many players forward. So Rovic couldn't take advantage. And now it's a roll reversal. It was Serbia caught short at the back and they are made to pay. Six points so far. This is against the host to attend to here. They started strongly. To go to the uh, half time mark. We were really no more than a start at this stage. She's good. And it's really clear again. Having a decent game, Mariana Altis. Crucial period, you feel this. Two half time. Need to keep in contention. He comes in doing much more than that, but Hibbert 
switch in the Spanish lead instead, and if they can get away, an opener for Russia, remember. They're already through to the final. Brilliantly take it from uh, Hibana. The foul by Kunic means there could be further punishment to come. Look at that, didn't even touch the sides. points in these championships and has opened her account for the semi-final where he went to the under 19 world championships a couple of years ago he played at euro league this year for halton avenida in spain and they're running away with it the lead is only growing at the start of this third quarter and it's a play for the semi-final and is continuing via and you just don't seem to have an answer they can't really get into their rhythm Beautifully taken. We're in a broad league here. Set their sights. Middle of it. We're about halfway through the third quarter now. Here comes Spain again. Three more points to Sass. That's for her. And they are utterly dominant. Semi final. This is Paris for Spain. Nimble, brilliantly judged. It's becoming a familiar sight, a familiar story. And Serbia simply have no answer. It's just not happening for them. Here's Leona Rodriguez. Just a more quicker Spain. So much sharper. It's almost exhibition stuff from them there. Will it be taken by Laura Hill? That expression serves it already. So much expected of it. She hasn't been able to deliver. Average 13.3 points per game at last summer's finals at this level. With the under 20s. And top that and still tonight. There is the Spain. Semi-final. It took them a long time though to establish that position. It was nothing compared to this. A signal of intense ahead of the final. They do go on and book their place. The only unbeaten team. They are really determined to make up for such a narrow setback a year ago. The rematch with Russia is the prize. Remember, in tomorrow night's final. Serbia is a host nation increasingly likely to have the seven from the bronze medal at best. Fall tonight, but it is a recent turnout, particularly from the home fans. Most of those, though, are very quiet right now. The Spanish just certainly enjoying themselves. Their team are enjoying themselves on the court, and here they come again. It's, it's sure now to involve the host nation. Go again against Poland. Not often you can talk with such certainty with uh, nearly seven minutes of a semi final still to play. Quite some time. Utterly dominated every quarter so far, Spain. And that is only continuing here. Rodriguez being introduced in order exactly lessening the threat that Serbia plays. So that Good run, and it's just had enough on it from my loop. Wow. Serbia against Spain. Look at the space. Utilised by Kisaf, that takes her into the... Oh, it hasn't finished yet. 
screen is there. I thought about the three points. Fly away. Statistic view choose to look at is fairly starting the disparity between the two teams. The scoreline is this uh, good an indicator again, isn't it? Not often an inaccurate reflection of the game. The test. Well, they wonderfully found their way through. William Forrester gets in on the axe. Another that really gets the opportunity. But he's determined to take it here. And the pressure to a degree is now off. Now, really able to, Chimino is able to retrieve possession comfortably enough. For too long, though. Will be attacked with pace. Better than Kernich. That's what we expected to see earlier on, really. Good smile on the face now. They've long since been resigned to their fate. Final seconds tick down in Novi Sat. One final go at the basket. Malou is not too bothered about that. It is all over. It has been, in essence, for quite some time in the most one-sided of semi-finals. Serbia simply swept aside on their own court by the all-powerful Spanish. 75 points to 38.